Today I'm going to show you how to make a car inside a Roblox studio. So, step one, well the first thing you want to do is um, get um, a part. You go over here and click that and then it'll generate a part. If it doesn't have that size, you can go there and select the bl a block. Once you do that, you're going to want to um, make sure this is one stud. That will make it a lot easier. And then just to check, you can make sure it does that and moves over a stud. Okay. If you do that, you can do this any size you want. If you want a very big size like this or something, then I recommend doing massless. But we're just going to go for this size. Seems decent. Decent. Now, you're going to want to do a cylinder. Why a cylinder, you ask? Um, this is for the wheel. So it can roll around like a car is supposed to. Obviously. <laughs> and then you can change it to whatever color you want. Also, for me, the color is um, showing off of the um, window. But, um, yeah. But before you try to duplicate that, you want to go to model and then surface. Click hinge, then click that side, then make sure that's in the middle of the brick. And then you can copy and paste it, and then make sure all of them are connected. Also, you, also you can like do this just to make it a little bit quicker, like that, and then rotate it. Okay, so you got the basic parts of the car. So now here comes the kind of hard part because none of this is really that hard. So you wanna, you're gonna want to um do that. Then go to. You're gonna want to do that. Actually, no, you don't want to insert a part. You want to go to workspace, insert a object, get vehicle seat. But just in case. You're going to want to go here, look at the front surface. It's facing that way. So we're going to make it face forward so it knows which way the car is supposed to go and all that. So once you got it right there, you can place the vehicle seat wherever you want. But, well, yeah, but you need to add a weld at the bottom of it so it sticks to the vehicle. And then... You can play. And then boom, you got yourself a working car. Make sure make sure um you don't set the base to massless like I did. It's only if it's like extremely big, like bigger than the base plate or something. I don't know why it would make it that big. But if you don't choose massless, it will kinda work normally. But yeah. You got yourself a working car. Just make sure to stop before turning it, or so it's gonna freak out. So yeah, there you go, a car. A very insane one. At that, just just don't turn rapidly, or else you're gonna get this. You're, yeah, you're gonna get this. You're gonna get it flung out the map. Exactly like that. <laughs> but yeah. You're welcome. You can also group it. Um, see. Yeah, you can also do that. Name it. Yeah, there you go. There you go. The shortest video you can probably possibly find, I guess. I forgot my outro again. Well, make sure to smash that like button, punch that subscribe button. Um, I forgot the rest. Drink, drink your water.